YouTube, what's going on? West Coast Gamers here. We are back with Rival Stars. We're finally getting into essentially the second episode of this series. And I'm choosing some new jockey uh, silks because I kind of got bored of my old ones. And I'm going with a different color scheme. Something I think I'll actually like. And let's go with the hearts. Is there a different color scheme I may like better? Yeah, this is cool. Helmets. Let's go with... Uh, See the pink with the stars, actually the blue and pink. It's kind of fire. Just want something different, that's all. Actually, we'll go with the stripe. How about that? Alright, cool. So, um, we're going to get into breeding here a little bit because I'm trying to produce a really good grade two horse so I can do the live events. Um, and I think I was gonna breed. Who was I gonna breed? Evening Jazz and Living Autumn? No. I'm trying to get a really good grade 2 horse. Hold on. Unknown Superstar. This Thistle. I think I was going to do Living Autumn for sure. And, um... The studs that I have... Silk Palace is my only stud. These two breed. It says I have a 53% chance of creating another grade 2, which is what I want. I don't want a grade 3. I want, like, a really good grade 2. And I'm hoping... So these are their, okay, so I see, these are their level one stats, so I would get a potentially better grade two depending on what I could do. Um, sorry, there's something going on in another game of mine. I could try her in Silk Palace again. I'm um, seeing they can create a decent grade two. Um, let's go ahead and use that and breeding successful it should be a grade two um, I don't know if we're gonna get another grade two or not I hope we do anyways let's go ahead and get into uh, races I don't know who I don't know who I'm gonna race we still have to race our rival I don't even think we have a horse that can compete in this league yet I haven't trained any of my grade threes really well so we're not gonna do that let's go to Parsons and We'll need to win this race two more times. 900 meters. So let's run with Evening Jazz. Yeah, Evening Jazz and Silk Palace look pretty similar. We'll go ahead and run with Evening Jazz, though. And we will be riding. So we'll see how this goes. As always, appreciate love and support you guys have been showing on the videos, even if you're not commenting. I see the likes and the analytics, so I know that you're watching. Um, but I would appreciate it if you did leave a comment. I always reply, so don't be afraid. And here we go. We're off and racing. I think this horse likes to be in the middle, if I'm not mistaken. I can't remember. Our silks actually don't look that great. <laughs> um, the color scheme. I might have to go with something different. Don't hear the volume. Is the game all the way up? Let's see. There we go. Wanted to make sure my game volume was on. We should definitely win this, though. Shouldn't be any problem. Got a good lead, comfortable lead. Uh, well, actually, no, we're in third right now. I didn't realize there was a horse on the outside over there. Sprint meter's charging perfectly. We'll smoke those two as soon as we get the chance, so no worries. I'm going to change my jockey silks. I'm not a fan of this. AI have these colors quite often. Yeah, we should. We're still in third, still in third, we're in second, we're in second, we're in first, okay. I can't see the other two horses. That is one thing I would like for them to change as far as the camera angles are concerned. I can't see what's going on on the outside. <laughs> Alright, we got that race. Um, so I was going to change my jockey silks. Actually, I might just go to the green and yellow, which is what I'm doing in God Race for 2000. Why not? <clears throat> silks, uh, there's kind of a green and green, yellow, and black. That's kind of the closest to it. I don't really want the black in there, though. I just kind of wanted, like, a green and yellow, but... Actually, this isn't bad. These, um, silks. Yeah, I kind of like these. It's not terrible. Go with the square, or... I always do the stars. I'm trying to come up with a little bit of variation for you guys. Um, what was I going to do? The two-tone? Nah. The pause. <laughs> the pause, basically. Uh, we can do green with this. Yeah, not the flashiest, but I like it better than where we were at previously. So we have to win one more race at that level. Uh, this is Parsons Apprentice. Uh, we win one more race, and then we unlock the third tier. 
of that. So we'll race on uh we'll race on Silk Palace this time. I need to really work on my grade three horses, but I'm trying to dom I'm trying to create like the perfect grade two horse and then I'll focus on my grade threes. Because I want to be able to dominate the, the grade two live events the way I can get more roses to acquire more stuff. So I'm trying to find the perfect breeding line for a grade two horse. And we're off. Okay, this is a long race, 2,000 meters, so we got, oh crap, we're on this side, <laughs> I wasn't paying attention, I was about to go to the outside rail and run, that would have been awful, that would have been absolutely awful, man. Okay, they're kind of pushing this pace a little bit, I don't like this. I feel like sometimes it's hard to, to like stay with the pace, um, I mean like you can be great at this game, but if your horse I guess doesn't have the right stats compared to the rest of the field i mean no amounts of good gamesmanship or whatever is, is going to get you to a point where you can keep up with the rest of the field you know you definitely feel that in this game 100 percent so uh we're kind of i don't i'm racing on silk palace silk palace likes to lead so i'm, I'm really i need to push a little bit yeah it's kind of falling asleep back there okay let's move over silk palace likes to be in front Move over, move over, move over. I don't care if we're like right on the inside, but this is good. Okay, move over some more. This is this horse really in the way? Okay, we're good. Sprint uh, meter is charging. Cool. I kind of like the green and white silks. I would just change the sleeves, maybe. Just I would want the sleeves to be yellow, and then I'd have like the perfect fit, which I can definitely do in Gallop Racer, and I think in Starters Order Seven, which I just started that as well. We're sitting comfortable though. We're sitting comfortable. We got plenty of uh, sprint charging. In fact, I can just up a little bit more. Okay, no, nah, well we're fine. We're the favorite too. As long as we get going at the right time, we should be able to smoke this horse. I have like what ahead of a lead on us. No biggie. The rest of the field isn't going to be much of a challenge either. So we'll get going here. Here we go. Let's get that jump. Yep, smoked him. About three, four lengths. Easy win. Easy win. All right. Um, I think that was the last race we needed to unlock the new um, the new course or the new distance. We might have to win one more. Let me see. Okay. Yep, we unlocked it. Nine hundred meters. Awesome. Um, we get more prize money a little bit. Of course, race three. Same group of horses. I might race a different horse or watch the AI race a different horse. Yeah, you know what? We'll watch the AI race my horse, Unknown Superstar. It's a grade three that I have not worked on at all. So, we will see what they are able to do here. And uh, hopefully, they can get a win for us. Hopefully. That is the key word. Like I said, we'll see. We shall see indeed. What is a field of nine or ten? I can't quite remember. Hopefully the AI jockey doesn't do terrible and we actually place, you know. Hopefully. Okay, not a great start. We're already kind of trailing, which is not what I want. Gotta do a little bit better than that. I don't think I'd come in first running this race, even with Unknown Superstar myself, but um, hopefully the AI jockey just doesn't have us lose. Uh, that's all I really care about. As long as we don't lose, I'm not gonna be too, too worried. Be honest with ya. Okay, 380 meters. We're getting some frame rate droppage, I don't know why. Um, and we're in 11th, so the jockey's just taking a nice old stroll, not really helping us out there like we need to. Wow, we are in dead last. Okay, it said we were going to come in fourth, or we were positioned to come in fourth. Coming in at dead last is unacceptable. Like, my goodness, that's so unacceptable. Well, that's the last time I put the AI on a horse, AI jockey on a horse that's not actually favorite to win. Like, my goodness. And my video froze. Okay. Sorry for the frame rate, guys. I don't know why that's happening, to be honest. 
Well, that's disappointing. I want to put on a superstar in another race and show you guys I can actually place decently on that horse. Way better than what AI Jockey just did. My goodness, that was awful. It was absolutely awful. I wonder if I can train uh, Unknown Superstar right quick just to give him something. No. No. Uh, our speed does suck, and our acceleration isn't great. I don't, I mean, I don't use my gold coins for anything else, so I don't mind buying tack until I hit the next level. I hit speed again. And we'll hit speed again. This will take 30 minutes. Then we'll focus on, I think we can do sprint energy. Oh no, we can only do one thing at a time. That's fine. Um, we can't race though, because he's training. I do wish they would change, I think they're changing some of the limitations of that, hopefully. Uh, Living Autumn? I can skip for free. I need to sell a horse or add more stalls. Can I add more stalls? I don't know if I can. No, I can't. I need to sell a horse. Who am I willing to sell? All my other horses are grade threes. I don't really want to sell any of them. Um, not really. Oh, well, she'll be done in three minutes. I'm, I'm, I wasn't paying attention. Okay, let's get this training of unknown superstar. I don't care. So I'm going to race. Okay. So let's see what we can do here. We're not going to be the favorite, but I'll show you. We can at least... I can place on this horse. Oh my goodness. Oh, no. We're not even favored? 1900 firm? You know what? Screw it. I'm still going to run anyways. Our odds aren't that much different from the first uh, race. Or the last race we did, so... I'm not going to come in dead last. I'm going to do my best. Our acceleration is not great, so she's definitely... I think he's... I don't know if I know the Superstar is a failure call. I actually have no idea what this horse is. <laughs> I'll have to look afterwards. Oh, gosh. That pace. Wait, wait. She, she likes to sit in the middle of the pack. She's not a front runner, is she? They're acting like she's a front runner. I'm confused. Oh, man. I got to use all this sprint energy just to get her up. And she's probably not even going to stay in the bubble too long. So yeah, they're just going to keep moving and keep moving and keep moving. Yeah. Dang it. I swore it said she was a middle runner. Why are they treating her like she's a front runner? That's annoying. That blue bar should be... Yeah, back here. It should have been back here the whole race. And I understand the positioning of the field accounts too. But my goodness, that's some bull crap. Treating her like she's a front runner when she's not. Are we coming in last? Oh, we are. Okay. We are coming in last. <sighs> well, this, that, I mean, this is tougher competition. No doubt. This is much, much tougher competition. Oh, I didn't want to do that. Sorry, guys. While we're stuck <laughs> looking at this. And I'll put her in a lower, a lower grade race. But still, like, she's a middle runner. And that bar was all the way towards the front. With the first three horses, like it, sh it should have been where I was at. I was literally right in the middle of the pack. That's that's kind of BS, to be honest. <sighs> Let me go double check. Um, stables. Unknown superstar is a mare. Yeah, she's a mare. And um, what's her pedigree? Let me go. I don't can't beat neck. So she just got by a beating of being a grade three. So she's probably not going to be the highest level of grade threes. Yeah, looking at her stats already. I mean, she can go to level 15. I don't know. I don't know what type of grade three she'll be compared to Thistle Complication, whose pedigree is a grade three and a grade two from Unknown Superstar. So I think he'll, have, he'll be a better grade three. And then Wool Moon Paradise... Grade two, grade two. So he'll probably be similar to Unknown Superstar. If that's a he. Yeah. So Moon Paradise and Unknown Superstar are probably going to be low tier grade threes, but I think Thistle Complication is going to be our high tier grade three. You're looking at that pedigree, all grade twos, and then one grade three, or level twos, whatever you want to call them. I'm going to race an Unknown Superstar again. Prove that this horse can win. Um. I'm positive the horse is a middle runner, and they just totally screwed me. 
Oh, front. Okay, I messed up. <laughs> I was going to say, I swore the horse was a, a middle runner, but it wasn't. So that's my fault. We'll go in this race. This is the... What, what track is this? Sewell Meadows, yeah. I know Superstar, definitely capped here. Um, distance is good. Track surface is good. I'll trust the AI. One last time. They should be able to get the W here. Should is the key word. And this might be the last race of the video. Um, as much as I love this game, it's kind of hard to do long-term Let's Plays on the iPhone because of the limitations. I've, I'm watching people play this game on, what, PS4, and obviously there's no limitations like there are as far as waiting for training and all that stuff. So, um, it's easier for them to do Let's Plays, but on the iPhone, it's much more difficult. So, I'm still going to keep this going as a series, but it's going to be, it's not going to be as frequent because of that, you know? Unfortunately, it's not really something I can control. I wish I could. Like I said, there's not much I can do. I'm on Superstar. We need a clean win here today to show that we can uh, obviously do what we do. <laughs> we should be able to get a clean win. Yeah, I made a mistake thinking that she was a front runner when she's, or thinking that she was a a mid pack runner when she's a front runner. So I was like, why is the bar at the front? She's a mid runner. And the game is like, no, she's a front runner. You doofus are in the middle. That's not where your horse likes to run. <laughs> so that's my fault for making that mistake. That is my fault indeed. My frames have been kind of crappy though. I don't know why that's been happening. Okay, she is leading, no doubt. She's a leading, I think she's leading at least by five lengths right now. We'll see in the next camera cut. Yeah, next camera cut should be cutting. Yeah, she's at least leading by five or six lanes, which is, I mean, she had to, this is essentially her dropping in class. This game is really fun. I love the presentation. I would love if Galb Racer, a new Galb Racer came out with these graphics and this gameplay. Oh my gosh, that'd be glorious. Easy win, though, for Unknown Superstar. Almost two whole seconds, six to seven length win. We'll take it. And on that note, ladies and gents, um, that's probably going to be the end of the video. I'll come back once I kind of, um, I don't know, figure out something else to do. Meet a new horse. Oh, my new horse is here. I still have to sell a horse, but who? Who do I sell? Because I really want to see what the stats are on that horse. <sighs> and I, I can't add another stall. I don't have enough. Complete more goals. Build it, it'll take 12 hours. What can I do to build the new stall? I don't actually know. Let's look at the story goals. Um, collect these. I mean, I don't care about selling a horse if it's not a horse I'm particularly attached to, or I don't feel like it's, you know, I'm in the barn that much. Um, yeah, we there's nothing we can do to add another stall, so I'm gonna get rid of somebody. Evening Jazz is almost maxed out and she's not I mean he's not better than Silk Palace unfortunately he's not better than his father stat wise I don't think so because he's 70 70 speed on sprint and if you go to his father which is Silk Palace Silk Palace is one point better in speed one point lower in, in sprint energy acceleration is at 74 I don't know if Evening Jazz is going to get that you know what I mean I don't know if evening acceleration. I don't know if he's gonna get to 74. So I'll go ahead and um sell him. He's done well. Evening jazz. Goodbye. You've been good. Welcome the new horse to the stable. And okay, nice. 45, 44, 40 flat grade three. I don't want a grade three. Uh, I didn't want a grade three. I wanted a high tier grade two, man. Mystery forgery. I'll just keep the name. Nah, look at all these. I don't want all these grade threes. I'm trying to get grade twos and I can't get one. I bred Living Autumn and Silk Palace. So it's like I have to breed one of these grade twos with like a really high grade. I have to breed Living Autumn or Silk Palace, which I'm just going to consider grade twos. Actually, it doesn't even make sense because the higher up we go in this game, technically you're dropping a grade. Where are, the, where are these ratings even called? I'm going to call it just uh, rating star two. I don't even know what to call them in this game. I'm sure there's a term. 
I'm going to say levels. Level twos. These level two horses with Silk Palace and Living Autumn. I can only use one of them. And I need to find a really high level one horse. Possibly. Because apparently breeding two. Well, that, not always though. Look, I... Look, Fossil Friendship and Living Autumn, which were both level two horses, gave me a level two Silk Palace. So, I guess I just have to find the right level two horse to breed. And all these grade threes. Like, I... Y'all are beautiful, but I don't need all of you. I'm trying to get a decent grade two. Because I, I can't get a grade four. Like, look at the live events I want to do. This is what I'm trying to get. I'm trying to get a good horse to compete in this time trial. You know? And I, I can't get a high tier grade two. And I don't have any grade fours. So this, great, this level three, level four time trials out of the question for me because a like, level three is not going to cut it against other people's level fours so that's why i'm trying to get a really high good high level two horse to, to run in the pacific uh, or the calm palm coast and i can't ah. so i'll look at these stats these two horses let's compare thistle complication 44 47 46 See, i think thistle complication because I know Superstar is a, a level 3. He's going to be a good level 3 horse. Mystery Forgery is not going to be a great level 3 horse. Because I'm just going to sell him already. Goodbye. I need a level 2. Like, Do I need to get a level 1 in order to make this happen? This is ridiculous. I can breed again. I'll have to breed with a different horse. Okay, so if I do Unknown Superstar, who is a level 3, with Stranger Song, who is a level 1, we should get a solid level 2. Maybe I'm, I was breeding the wrong horse. Yeah, maybe we can get a good high level 2. Thistle Complication is also a level 3. They both have the same stats. Who's better, though? I like the long distance. We'll do Thistle Complication and Stranger Song. This should give us a solid level 2. Yeah, this is gonna. This could potentially give us a level four. Don't want that. I want a, a solid level two, and this is gonna give us a level three. We're not doing that. So we'll do Stranger Song, and Thistle Complication. This should give us a decent level two. I'm hoping. Okay. And uh, we can skip the breeding now. Ooh, nice. Level 2, 44, 45, 44, not bad. This might be a decent level 2. Sensational Slipper. Um, sensational Popcorn. <laughs> sensational, I'm going to call her Sensational. Or is this a stud? I can't, I don't remember. Sensational Blade. I like how you can see what names are commentary um, friendly for the commentator to announce. Sensational Blade. This should be commentary friendly. Yes. Now, you're a mare or a stallion. stallion. Okay. 44, 45, 44. Yeah. This could be a decent level two. 2,000 distance, firm, pack position, middle. I like it. All right, guys. This is going to do it for this uh, episode of Rival Stars. Appreciate your love and support. Make sure to smash the like button and leave comments in the comment section below. I do reply to all comments. And uh, we'll be back with some more horse racing gameplay in action very soon. West Coast Gamer Sound. Until next time, have a great and fantastic day. See you and goodbye.